Hello everyone and welcome to another episode. My name is Ebolon and in today's video we are going to count down top 10 best games of 2024. So if you missed any of these games, I don't care. As you may not know and I never talked about it, 99% of viewers of this channel didn't subscribe to the channel. 99%. It means that I'm bad, my video sucks. See, I know that. But into creating better videos, I really need your support. So subscribe now or don't or and ignore me and watch my bullshit videos again and again and until eternity comes and all of us meet our sentence death I, <laughs> i'm kidding let's go let's start to the video number 10 stellar blade Stellar Blade, created by south korean studio shift up is a wild and over-the-top action game it borrows ideas from other popular action games and anime. The story follows Eve, a super soldier, who must save the last humans from mysterious alien creatures that have destroyed Earth. The plot is simple and predictable, but the game's exciting combat and heavily sexualized character keep players engaged. Number 9. Final Fantasy VII Rebirth Square Enix Final Fantasy VII Rebirth is the second part of the trilogy that retells the story of the classic RPG. This remake not only updates the game's graphic and gameplay, but also expands on original's world. It improves on its predecessor, Final Fantasy VIR Remake, with better gameplay, a larger scope, and a new open world elements. Number 8. Indica Indica, developed by Odd Meter, takes a deep dive into religious satire. The game tells the story of Indica, a nun in a Russian convent who is mistreated by her fellow nuns because she can hear the devil's voice in her head. Number 7. Thousand X Resist Thousand X Resist, created by Sunset Visitor, is a story-driven indie game with striking anime-inspired visuals. Player control Watcher, one of six sisters' clones, living in an underground bunker. Watcher's job is to record the memories and experiences of humanity. The game's plot revolves around uncovering the mystery of how humans were wiped out by an alien species called the Okopan. Number 6. Taken 8. Taken 8 is the latest entry in a long-running 3D fighting game series. The story continues in a intense rivalry between Kazuya Mishima and his son Jin Kazama. The game features over-the-top action scenes and the globetrotting narrative as Jin gathers a team to take down his father in a King of Iron Feast tournament. Number 5. Elden Ring Shadow of the Entry from Software's Elden Ring Shadow of the Entry is a massive expansion for a popular game Elden Ring. It introduces a new open world region for players to explore, filled with new challenges and adventures. Number 4. Helldivers 2 Helldivers 2 is a squad-based shooter inspired by a sci-fi film Starship Trooper. Players are sent to hostile planets to fight off hordes of bugs, cyborgs, and other enemies. The game is a third-person shooter with a satirical tone and a focus on a cooperative gameplay. Number 3. The Balatro Balatro is a unique take on a roguelike genre. Instead of just randomly generated levels and enemies, it adds a twist by incorporating poker elements. The game challenges player to use a strategy and luck in a high-stakes setting. Number 2. Animal Well Animal Well is a Metroidvania game inspired by classics like Metroid and Castlevania. It features 2D side-scrolling gameplay with deep exploration, fast-paced action, and lots of backtracking to discover hidden areas. And number 1. Hades 2 Hades 2 continues to impress even in its early access phase. Developer Supergiant Games has used the player feedback to refine the game, much like they did with the first Hades. The game is shaping up to be one of the best of the year. Thank you everyone for watching this episode. I just packed it for you to just watch it fast and enjoy your time. My name is Ebolan. If you enjoyed this episode, give it a thumbs up and it really helped my channel and helped me to keep creating content. My name is Ebolan. Until the next episode, peace.